All right, y'all, so today is the 12th. We're doing all the fun stuff with Varseleka. Um, so I'm probably gonna be heading out here in like 20 minutes. I'm gonna try and get there at about 11, check out the facilities. Of course, maybe do some shopping a little bit later on. And then of course we have that meet and greet at, at 2 p.m. So I'm pretty freaking excited to see who's coming. Meet some of the subscribers. I gotta say, it's cool commenting and, and you know replying to y'all in the Discord and whatnot, but like meeting face to face is just so much cooler, I think. I haven't met many subscribers I in real life, maybe like a handful, less than five. So it's gonna be pretty cool to actually meet y'all and, and have some, some chats and discussions. So I'm pretty excited about that, not gonna lie. A little bit nervous. I, I will say I've never done a meet and greet before, so I'm not exactly sure what's like expected of me, if that makes sense, but it should be a good time. And again, checking out Vara Seleka is gonna be pretty freaking legit as well. But yeah, I'm probably gonna head out, try and get an Uber um, if there's one available. If not, I guess get a, a taxi because it's a little bit further from my Airbnb. Now, Jenny was also telling me that they had a, a gym at Varsileka, which would be pretty freaking legit to actually do like a little bit of a workout because although I've been walking around a lot and I did like some rollerblading, actually getting in you know a proper workout would be kind of cool as well. So yeah, I'm gonna bring some gym clothes just to leave that possibility open. I have the laptop going right now, uploading some videos, because again, I'm still trying to make sure that the, the videos are up to date, and I have videos scheduled for while I'm actually here in Finland, so that should be good. Um, I do need a converter still, so I think my laptop is probably gonna die before I upload this video, which kinda sucks, but I'll, I'll just finish it up later after I get a converter. But yeah, um, pretty excited, should be a good day. I'll take you guys along for the ride, and of course I'll take all the, the B-roll shots so you guys can kinda see my travel, I guess. <laughs> the weather today is definitely different, super like foggy. What's up? It's cool actually being here now. Actually, let's take this. Tour. Okay. Do you want to take a short tour? To, like, sure. The whole, like everything. Yeah. Before we go upstairs. Yeah, that's cool. And so here's our shop. It continues. Like it's a U. Okay. It's the cashier. Okay. Nice. So yeah, that's the, the shop. Nice. Uh, there's the behind those curtains is the Sotima bar. Okay. Cool. It's not open yet. It opens at noon, and so that's the shop. Gotcha. And uh, if there's something, <laughs> this is cool. Like uh, that's only in the storage. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And not in the shop. People can order it from here. Okay. Also, they can make online orders to pick up from the store, and that's their like pick up place. Gotcha. So nice. It's a pretty nice setup. Uh, Sheesh. <laughs> Holy cow. Let's go first to the reception. <laughs> All right. And uh, you have like a laser pointer in your <laughs> finger, and you have laser pointers like here. Yeah, yeah. And you have uh, like pads and computers everywhere, like screens. Right. And the pads tell you like which you need to go to. Okay. And then it points to the box <laughs> that you need to pick up from. Okay. And then it like you. Uh, Put your finger fingers here, and it lasers the like. Okay, next one. I can't even imagine how expensive this yeah. whole system must have been. Yeah, you don't really need to like <laughs> press anything like when you're picking up something. You just like do the laser stuff like do 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 really fast. Weird. Yeah. I see this is a popular item. What is it? Just like padding for the. Those are the best ones I have used. Like inner, like that go inside your pant. Yeah, yeah. It's really flexible okay and it's soft on the other side and hard on oh the other. yeah huh that's neat and it's really cheap <laughs> it's like 10 euros oh shit okay here. that's pretty smart yeah and it's been out of stock for like two months <laughs> or something okay and now we got it so everyone's ordering okay yeah yeah i see it <laughs> nice yeah <laughs> damn this building is massive <laughs> <laughs> shit this is one of our like we, our marketing and sales team is in, divided into two. Okay. And this is one part of it. We have our own studio. We produce like all the videos and photos and everything. So <laughs> okay. media. Yeah, yeah, and I gotcha. Product pictures ourselves. 
It's where, it's where the, the real magic happens then. Yeah. <laughs> are those real? Airsoft. Okay, I was about to say. Yeah. Wow, those are good airsoft those guns. Those are only the ones that we have on display. <laughs> There's like a bunch yeah. of guns in uh, in a closet there. Like just Mostly for stuff. like props for yeah. videos and stuff? Yeah. Gotcha. Okay, this is like super weird. I'm about to work out in, in Varus to like a, like... <laughs> it's such it's such a weird thing. I mean, I've seen like pictures and I've seen videos of this actual place, but to actually be here and be working out, especially, is just weird to think about. Is rowing like pretty brutal as far as like just cardio training? It's boring. It is boring, <laughs> and you can't like play with your phone or anything. Yeah, no, I like to go out to the nature. Yeah. And walking is boring. <laughs> so, I feel that. Like, Mountain biking is fun, and uh, if I, if I, for example, bike uphill, I have to do it walking speed, or otherwise it gets too much. Yeah, I mean, I'm just horrible at biking uphill in general. Yeah. Yeah, since I was away for a couple months, my legs have gotten a lot weaker. Yeah. So, I need to work back up to it. Like, trust me, I could do heavier, but like... Yeah. <laughs> but why do you need to say that to a stranger? <laughs> right. No, I understand that. It's like a pride thing. Yeah. <laughs> and also the competitiveness. Yeah, exactly. a pretty decent workout. I'm like really, really tired and kind of groggy. I mean, I slept really bad last night, so I think I'm just kind of sleepy and groggy from that. But yeah, that workout took a lot out of me, so freshen up a little bit for this meet and greet, so I have some, some energy for all of y'all. <laughs> so let's try to not get lost here. <laughs> Honestly, kind of hard considering how big this place is. <laughs> all right, so let's look around. I'm definitely going to be doing some shopping here, so try and get some ideas for what I'm going to be getting. Not going to lie, I'm like a huge sucker when it comes to merino wool, so I might have to cop some of that as well. It doesn't come cheap, but it's like really good stuff. So, of course, the big goal is going to be getting some MO5 here. So, that's what I'm going to be checking out right now. Let's see what we can cop. You lose your ring. Can then please have a hot one on my side? Oh, good. So, they'll get disciplined on it or something. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, 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 exactly. How's it going? Fine, thanks. You? Good. I did some shopping myself. And we decided that we'd bring you our patch. Hell yeah. What is this called, you said? Uh, it's uh, the Northern Ostrobothnia Regional Companies Guild. 
Okay. Uh, the regional companies are uh, a reservist organization within the Finnish military. Okay. Oh, oh hey, nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. Of course. Yeah, I'm yeah. CEO of Paros Collectors. All right. Yeah. Yeah. I've videos with you and, uh, and Jenny. Yeah. Talking <laughs> about like SRA and whatnot. Yeah. So I'm staying for six days total. Been here for a couple of days now. Yeah. But I, I gotta say the jet lag wasn't as bad as I thought. The hardest thing is trying to sleep. Because, Always light. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. All the windows have a curtain except for one. Okay. So I'm like, <laughs> I wake up at like three and I'm like, okay, I guess it's time to get up. We live 650 kilometers north of here. You try sleeping there, the sun doesn't set. It's, it's like pretty much yeah, that. Yeah, it's around yeah. the clock like yeah. this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> what is that? Is that a, I mean, it looks like a knife, but it's the size of a sword. That's uh, that's a kind of the, the special item we did uh, for the store opening when we oh. opened this facility. Hmm. So it's the uh, same model as this uh, our scrum on, oh. which is the big knife what we have. That's cool. Uh, it's not, it's not sweaty. A little bit. Are you like, hiking over here? <laughs> How's it's been good. I've been saying the hardest thing is probably just getting used to like the, the, the light. Yeah. <laughs> Vacation, you're not really supposed to sleep that much. So it's, yeah. it's, been, it's been good. I know it's because I'm American or tattoos or whatever. Thank you guys, Mary. Um, no, since, uh, since I told you about... Yo, hey, it's nice to meet you. Yeah, of course. Name? Name? What is it? Papsa. Papsa? Yeah. Amy. I, I will try and put some reflection on it. Ace Dixon, and there you are. What is it? Alvin. Alvin? Alvin. Alvin? Yeah. Tuomas. Tuomas. You want something to drink? Um, maybe water? I'm like super dehydrated. I mean, I drank last night. Uh, Longero. What is it, like a salmiaki? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So I'm very dehydrated. Is that good, Mr. Cool morning, sir? Yeah, it is. Yeah, I'm not wearing any of my merch. <laughs> oh, here. Alright, you guys are going to be in the vlog, say what's up. <laughs> i got gotten so much like B-roll at this point, it's going to be kind of hard to edit everything. <laughs> It's also in the US. Like uh, I remember when I was in uh, Manhattan, and people from Florida say that oh, oh damn, it's, it's it's so expensive. Here. Yeah, there's a lot of disparity between a lot of states. Florida is super cheap, and they don't have like any taxes. But you go to New York, and it's like 10% taxes, and everything is just more expensive. But now with inflation, it's expensive. Different directions. Go away. Yeah. Okay. Hello. Oh, hey. This is for you. Awesome. I appreciate and it. And please come and let me poison you. Okay. <laughs> it's not right. my thing. I need to do it. Okay. I lose my reputation if I don't do it. <laughs> What's going on? Poison? Poison? It looks it looks very similar to Marine Corps martial arts. It is. Stuff, it is. It is. I mean, human body is what it is. Right. right. So Physics as yeah. well. Yeah. So very this cool. is the. Oh shit. Yeah. So we actually train. This is the real deal. So. And you do like full contact with these training knives? Not with this. Oh, you know, not, yeah, not this one. Hopefully not. Yeah. <laughs> we spar with those, but it's only when you when you reach the black, black belt degree. So you need to kind of like. So the basic drill, really, for example, is that you you cut, you cut, you move this, and you yeah. can do this kind of like stuff. Okay. So and then you can disarm when. Okay. It went to the grappling and I grabbed the guy from back of the helmet. Okay. It's a pretty nice place. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, okay, it's a good place to put the knee on. But because of course he has all, all oh, the shit, shit there. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I, I kicked my knee straight to his radio oh, on the corner and oh. I was like, oh, yeah, 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 right there. It's a cruddy dude. There's a basic tool of Finnish soldier. Our Oh, hell yeah, that's freaking scary. So, Thanks so for I, yeah. Dude, this is coming awesome. Visit us and 
hopefully you had a good time here. Yeah, I did. I really do appreciate it. Like, it's been awesome. Yeah, Especially but... just the Finnish people in general have been awesome. <laughs> this is sick. Yeah. Thank you very, very much. Yeah. Enjoy your time. Yeah, I will. Safe travels. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, kiitos. We serve it in a metal. Because, I like it. You know, you're gonna have to. Should so, I take it like a shot yeah. or? Okay. Just. All right. Enjoy. Let's try it. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually pretty good. Huh? Yeah, it goes down so a lot bad. smoother. Yeah. Yeah. That's and good. And it's really fucking cheap. It's like <laughs> oh, shit. Twenty percent alcohol, and this is like under ten euros. So. Yeah, you know, I, I mean, it's, nice. that's why it's, it's, it's very popular among uh, students. I like the touch of the metal cup, especially. You know, we are all class here, you know. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys, so I just got back from spending the day with the Varosteleka crew, and I gotta say, it was just really, really fun. So I got there pretty early, maybe like 11 o'clock, and I did a workout. I mean, I got like a little tour. Uh, Jenny was giving me a, a tour of like the, the whole building, and it was a lot bigger than I thought. It was just really, really cool to actually check it out. I've seen videos, especially like by Forgotten we Weapons and whatnot. I've seen pictures, but like actually being there was just kind of like trippy. But yeah, I got to do a, a pretty decent workout in the gym. They have like a really nice gym there. So I got a little, you know, a little workout in, which is pretty freaking sweet because I mean, with vacation, you kind of expect to not really be working out and even not like eating the best. So it was definitely like cathartic uh, in that I was able to, you know, actually get a, a decent workout in. And the gym is pretty freaking nice. So that was also pretty surprising. Um, oh yeah, then I went down to the store portion I got a little bit lost, so there's that. But yeah, I was checking out the store, which is pretty cool. And it, again, I've seen a bunch of pictures of the of the shop, um, like the Forgotten Weapons tour of the shop, and just reacting to the Finnish Defense Forces and seeing like the kind of gear that they use, and actually going to a store that supplies the Finnish Defense Forces and people who serve in it with all this gear, and actually being able to like walk the premises again, it's just it's just kind of trippy. So. That was really, really cool. Now I started to meet some of y'all, which was awesome. Did the meet and greet. And I, again, like, so it was from two to 5 p.m., but it just flew by. And partly because the, the awesome, uh, I guess the awesome bartender at the uh, bar Sotima was giving me some pretty interesting drinks. Some of them were stronger than others. Some of them are sweeter than others. But it, again, it's cool to get like a taste of what Finnish people would commonly drink and, and what have you. So that was pretty awesome. Had some really, really cool conversations. Being able to go to a place and do like a meet and greet is just, it's so cool. Again, like I say, commenting and, and talking to some of y'all on the Discord is awesome. But being able to like meet face to face is just like, again, it's like weird. It's like people care enough about the channel to come out and meet me. It's just, it's really, really cool. And I felt really honored. And then um, Yadi was uh, there as well. I talked to him, got a little introduction. He gave me this really, really badass knife. Now, I was thinking of like hanging this up with the other knives in my, in my background, but I feel like I'd be doing a disservice to how nice this knife actually is. So I'm definitely going to have to throw this on one of like my pistol belts and try and get some use out of it so I can do it some justice. Cause yeah, it just, it's a knife that's meant to be used, so I think I should do that instead. So that was that was really awesome. Again, I was just I felt very very honored, um, and again, just the people of Finland are so nice and so generous. So yeah, it was a fantastic day. So tomorrow uh, I'm planning to go to Suomenlinna, and then um, one of y'all actually volunteered to show me around and give me access to some cool locations. So that'll be pretty interesting, of course. I need to switch the battery out because this one's kind of dying. But yeah, I'll bring the video camera, take some pretty cool footage because the weather is supposed to be a little bit cloudier tomorrow, but that's totally all right. I think I've been pretty lucky with the weather so far, to be honest. So that should be cool. Um, and then do the podcast with the Mighty Finland guys. So that'll be interesting. And then the next couple days are going to be filled with a, a few different things. So I'll, I'll sort of explain it as it goes because there's a lot of kind of moving pieces. But yeah, today was fantastic, and I'm definitely looking forward to the next few days. So yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video if I split this. I'll probably have to split this into another video, but 
Yeah, thank you. Especially everybody who came out to the Bar, bar Sotima. I know there's a lot of y'all that wanted to come out, but you had other like reservations or plans. So uh, it, it's, it's fine. It was a fantastic time and it was cool to meet some of y'all, but I understand, you know, a lot of y'all had other stuff going on, but it was, it was really, really cool. And again, I just feel really honored to have met a lot of y'all and had some cool conversations and whatnot. But yeah, that's it for this video. I'm gonna chill. It's still pretty early in the day. I mean, it's hard to tell, especially with the, the sun anyway. But yeah, I'm gonna chill for a little bit, eat some snacks, try and get some of this editing done before I actually head back to the States because there's gonna be a lot of camera footage that I need to go through. But yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for coming out. Thanks for supporting the channel. I, I really do appreciate it. It's, it's just really weird to think about that there's people that will come out and meet me. I don't know, it's just, it's, it's weird. But again, thank you guys. Um, hopefully you enjoyed the video. I'll see you all in the next one.